Hello everyone and welcome to Not Overly Critical Gamer and Brigands Play Resident Evil 5. Your shop on the Hello. Town and rendezvous with your contact. You better hurry. Okay. Alright, let's do this. Indeed. Brigands is playing Chris, as he has never played this game before. I've only played it once on the Xbox, so I'm going to be playing the lovely Shava. This guy is still, like, intently looking at my shoes. Yeah, well, he's a creeper. He wants some shoes. Okay. If you're familiar with Resident Evil, I'm sure you're familiar with uh, Chris. Shava is a character they made up on the spot for this game. I kind of think oh. it was to avoid uh, racial backlash, as we will be in Africa killing lots and lots of African people. So it's less racist if there's also an African person killing African people. It's in the bag. That's probably a dead body. To the butcher shop on the edge of town. I think this guy wants it's probably more like the potatoes. Shop. Better hurry. Probably potatoes. Sounds like the Silent Hill Siren. Yeah, no, I was about to say, wait a minute. What game are we playing again? <laughs> I don't think it's all rusty and shitty. <laughs> Head stalks out. Oh, that'd be swinging. creepy. You'd have to fight like zombie dogs and lickers and hunters and stuff like that. And then Pyramid Head just shows up. <laughs> yeah. Probably make this game scary. Oh, yeah. Uh, wait a minute, that's not supposed to happen. There's going to be a lot of comparisons along the way <clears throat> comparing this game to its predecessor, it's Resident Evil 4. Because, in my eyes, Resident Evil 4 is one of the best action games ever made, and then this... not so much. But, it's... still okay. This is fresh and quality meat. Oh, Where are we? Oh. We're inside the butcher ship. So yeah, I haven't played this in a while. My map says we have to go this way. Oh, the map. Yeah. Ha! <laughs> Open it like a ball, just kick it. Good, you're both here. Come. <laughs> and here's uh, Liam O'Brien doing a weird accent. <laughs> you too. This way. But maybe because of the new government, the people around here are a little on edge. You should do what you came here to do and go home. Yeah, they really roll out the red carpet for us. Well, we had to get to the airport first. So we get home. Yeah. Take a boat. I have your weapons for your gear. <laughs> Jack them. Uh oh. Briefcase full of goods. Grab your weapons. The you operation's already started. There we go. Equipped. <laughs> <laughs> Destination coordinates. Town squares up ahead. Go <laughs> through there. Alpha team's waiting at the deal location. Good. What do you know about Uroboros? Mostly just rumors. Something about visions of a doomsday project. No, doomsday no. sounds about right. Oh, and apparently no. it is no rumor. You're kidding, right? You no. must find a man named Irving. He is our only lead. He's our only lead. Find Irving. Yep. Dark doesn't sound like an African and be name. Careful it's more like a <laughs> British person name. So, like RE4, RE5 doesn't have any zombies in it. They're all either Plaga things or um, the new Aurora Boros things, which will remember we're a later. team. Whatever happens, we stick together. Spoil. Don't worry. Oh, hey, I may not box. be as big as you, but I can still hold my own. I can still hold my own. So, one of the reasons we decided to play through this one together is because, as I said, Briggs has never played <laughs> RE5 before. And if you've ever played RE5 solo, you know that the AI controlled partner is just terribly, terribly programmed. Like, uh, the intelligence denominator on this is just ridiculously low. But the co-op in this game is pretty solid. So, it seemed like the... Is that a 
bag? Perfect opportunity. There's an animal carcass on the table. It's for some ceremony. Oh, is it? Bonds of wickedness. Yeah, I've only I've only heard um rumors of actually never played the game of uh, oh hey green herb. I've only heard rumors of how oh hey another green herb. Check that one. I've only heard rumors about how um, how bad the AI was. Like you get a scratch and she's like oh here's a first aid spray. Might as well use it on you. Yeah, she will use up any ammo and any health items you give her whenever she feels like it. Hurry up. That so. Doesn't doesn't, um... Yeah. You know. they, they took everything about RE4 that made it wonderful, and they just ruined it. And I don't know why. Oh, no. <clears throat> no, Tinnacle Monster. Close your mouth, dude. Oh, no. Freeze! So that would be the Lost Plagas from the last game. <laughs> How did they not see that? Uh oh. Are you okay? Like, uh, hey, man. You doing okay? <laughs> uh oh. Oh, he's bleeding out of his eyeballs and nose. That's probably not a good sign. Oh no. Oh lord. Knife! To the face! Now yeah, the knife done. to the face doesn't actually do as much as it used to. In RE4 you can combo that into a... A kill move. What kill. the hell just happened? They didn't move like any zombies either. Oh, well, that's right. All right Chris, okay, Chris, there hasn't been any zombies in this game since <laughs> Dreamcast, so... Yeah. Well, Chris, uh, I don't... He's never uh, encountered the Las Vegas. He hasn't. hasn't. That was Leon's thing, but... <clears throat> yeah, too bad. Too bad it's not just another Leon game. Leon's a boss. Uh, so is Chris. Chris is a super mega super boss. Yeah, but... Chris and Leon are both playable in RE6, but I hear it's not particularly amazing. I don't know. I haven't played it though, so I'm not gonna. My comments. It's, it's supposed to bring back the zombies and stuff. So as long as they do that, I mean, pretty much got the premise for your yeah. average awesome Resident Evil game. Why in the world? Are we? Yeah, like I said, I haven't played this. I, I played this when it first came out on the Xbox. I haven't played it since. I played this one time, uh -oh. so this is. A somewhat fresh experience for me. Uh oh, they're pissed. Yep, run. Hey! You conveniently placed open door. How convenient. Oh, look, oh. conveniently placed <laughs> barring for said door. The locals were hostile and we had to use force. This is the only door in the whole town that has that. Those are. Roger on the local. Oh, that's a good name. Your order yeah. still stand. What does that mean? Are you playing keyboard and mouse or controller? Yes. Okay. Keyboard See, I'm, I'm doing controller. I sort of feel like this is the kind of game that... Keyboard. I, I, I wouldn't personally be able to do as well. Uh, oh, here's M. Oh, you're uh, you're low on ammo. Why don't you take that? Am I? Yeah. I don't even know how to open it. Yeah, I'm low on ammo. Oh, here's some gold. So, it, like in the previous game, Resident Evil 4, we can collect money in order to buy upgrades and stuff. But unlike Resident Evil 4, what are you buying, stranger? the super cool shopkeep guy, we uh, just have to deal with a little menu for... Oh, that's... Wait, uh, so he's not in here? Oh, that moved. When you walked by, that's gross. I probably just bumped into it. No, there's no shopkeep or anything. It's just a really bland menu. It sort of kind of takes away from the whole experience. It was weird that yeah the <laughs> the merchant was really weird. He well, was really out of place. <laughs> yes and no because he did carry that gun with like infinite ammo. <laughs> right. Well, oh. the the whole like 
he's always where you are kind of thing. Well, I mean, the game's pretty linear, so... It's right. not like he has many other Well, if you shoot him and kill him, he's still in the next place. So, I think it's like a squad of merchant brothers or something. <laughs> uh, I need a fire uh, herb herb anyway. Inventory. I have a red herb and a green herb that I can combine to make a red and green herb. How are you oh, doing on hey. ammo? Uh, you, I, you have one more than I do, but you can go ahead and take that. Check that herb. Then. Oh. If you oh. notice my inventory, I have maybe a thing or two that I shouldn't have. It's because uh, there was an earlier run of just the first level. Just to get back into the swing of things and such. Test. Test. Ah! Uh oh. When I was doing a GIA, they need some time. Well, we're not supposed to know what they're saying. I mean, Shava might. Yeah. I don't know how native Shava is. So maybe I should get some titles with Shava. <laughs> that works. Oh, oh Liam O'Brien, no! Oh. Oh, he's not gonna be. He's doing that that accent in hell now. Huh. That guy has <laughs> good vision. Yeah. Especially we're in shades. Yeah. The <laughs> Plus one to uh, increase vision. That's right. Cool ammo. Yeah. Oh man. Oh, oh those aren't fresh tomatoes. Yeah, those are all rotten. Ugly. Oh, more ammo. I I, I strongly believe Shava's inclusion was just to avoid backlash because I think the second player character would have been much more. Um, Sympathetic or enjoyable if it was like Rebecca or someone else, like a, oh, yeah. an established hey. Resident Evil franchise character. Yeah. Yeah, Rebecca was cool. Yeah, it could have easily been Rebecca. Another Rebecca in this game. Hey, that guy went on the roof. Uh oh. I just looked at the. Red I would say Jill, but Jill does make an appearance in this game. So. She, spoilers. She, she has a part of the story. Well, it's not really spoilers. If you watch the opening cutscene, she's in it. Oh. Oh. I, the cutscene that oh. I I will be mo magically movie editing into the beginning. <laughs> so that people can see it. I'm not sure if. Oh no. That guy just appeared out of nowhere. So did that guy. Go. He, like super super speed. Kirk, come in. The locals are hostile. The gate is sealed, and we're trapped. We need backup, and we need it right now. Roger that. Just stay tight. I'm oh, on hey. my way. Did you hear that, Shabba? Don't swing an axe. Away. Got it. I just hope he gets here quick. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> I made a big mistake. Here. Oh. There's a guy right behind me, isn't there? Yeah. Oh, Shabba. Uh oh. Oh boy! We gotta go. Yep, I need to pick up this gold first. Gonna go back inside. I'm gonna. Oh boy. Go away, mean man. Run, 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 run! Okay, I just set the big mean man on fire. Oh, behind you! Behind me! Yeah. I, uh, I'm 
popped him in the face. Right on. Yeah. Look at this guy. Who that? You don't get that kind of problem from zombies. Zombies are smart. Oh, no, 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 no. I almost got marked by uh, Axeman. Axeman! Oh, be right back. Ass. I have a full um, stash of stuff, and there's green herb. You can kill yourself. I have no idea how to open my herb. It's, uh. Oh, yeah, you're playing keyboard. Again. <laughs> there's just no yeah. end to them. We've got to hold out till Kurt gets here. Oops. I didn't mean to use that myself. Where are you? I'm running around. You need to meet up with me so I can kill you. That's Axeman. Oh, yeah. oh, sweet! Axeman just killed a whole bunch of zombies for us. Or lost in the Or Lost in the There's some ammo back here. Oh, you can take it. Ha! Me. You sure? Yeah. Go ahead. All right. I need to come heal you though. I'm on my way. I see the map. Yeah, I'm in this little house. Oh, you're in the house. I'm in oh. the house, not on top of the house. Well, that makes things a little more um. Okay. Oh, big mean man. Just. I just kicked that dude in the face. Which one? The big mean one. Oh, Bron. <laughs> he probably doesn't like that thing too much. Or that sort of thing. I don't know. So, this is very reminis reminiscent of the... Uh, first, or er, first. I consider it the first of its type of Resident Evil game. Where you have to... Stay alive running around the town in Resident Evil 4 while you wait for something. I don't think there's any way we can speed up this process. There you are. Oh, yeah, like in Resident Evil 4, you have to Sheva, how are you holding up? Right? I'll be there yeah. shortly. Yeah. Yeah. Just hang in there. Stop for just a second. Come here. Oh, we need. You gotta move. Uh, oh, hey. Sweet. Thank you. Alright, let's go. Ooh, oh, oh, I got so lucky just now. <laughs> uh, oh, oh, this, this, this axe guy. This, axe man? This, yeah, he's swinging uncontrollably and he's just killing out the uh, flogger. Yeah. Oh boy. Excuse me. Oh, no oh that's axe man. Oh, oh shit. Oh, this way. I'm getting really lucky. Uh, if you come to the house, you can pick up some ammo. Uh, a boom, axe man. Oh, yeah, anyway. I'm gonna take out the door. Find some cover. Find some cover. Find some cover. <sighs> Look how long that took him. Yeah, it's not a helicopter. It should be like. It should be just. Uh, been here like 20 minutes ago. It's delicious water. Boom, headshot. That's a good thing about a bazooka. You can just aim it in the general direction and it's instantly a headshot. <laughs> Alright! Chapter 1. I got an A. So did I. Alright, next time on Not Overly Critical and Brigands Play... Not Overly Critical, Not Overly Critical Gamer. That's me. And Brigands Play Resident Evil 5. We continue to march forward towards our inevitable oh. deaths. Oh yeah. See I you next time. Later. I want to knock you.